we're talking about, as you as you rightly point out, is the is the protocol where there are, there are, there remain a lot of issues to be solved. It it, it remains extraordinary that twenty percent of all the external checks conducted on the perimeter of the whole EU uh, take place uh, in Northern Ireland. I think it's extraordinary that thirty drugs, including cancer drugs, are currently uh, forbidden from moving from uh, Great Britain uh, to Northern Ireland. To say nothing of the problem of of chilled meats. Well, hang on. What about this? This uh, document order... is talking about checks both ways. And that's wrong, so, because there won't be checks. So you're saying that this, this is wrong, the government's own impact assessment is wrong, your Brexit secretary is wrong, all these people are wrong, and you're well, right. Yes, because, because there, there's no question of there being checks on goods going uh, NIGB or GBNI. Boris Johnson sold his oven-ready Brexit deal on the promise there would be no checks on goods going between Great Britain and Northern Ireland, and from Northern Ireland to Great Britain. There's no question of there being checks on goods going uh, NIGB or GBNI. And this is where we are today. It remains extraordinary that 20% of all the external checks conducted on the perimeter of the whole EU uh, take place uh, in Northern Ireland. So the Prime Minister saw his deal to the public on a barefaced lie. When is he going to be held accountable for this? 